Imagine a general purpose robot deployed aboard a U.S. naval ship. To be an effective crewmate, it would have to be able to recognize and interact with others, navigate the complex environment, and even participate in damage control duties. We at the Naval Research Laboratory are working on addressing some of these challenges. Hello, Octavia. Hello, Eric. Octavia recognizes individuals by combining the results from multiple classifiers, including facial and speaker recognizers, as well as complexion and clothing histograms. Knowing with whom the robot is interacting allows the system to use individualized models for speech and gesture recognition. Loading firefighting actions. Octavia, we are in need of your assistance. Limited language processing for verbal commands is accomplished by spotting keywords in the text output of a commercial speech recognition engine. Please follow me to the supply room. We detect and track individuals using time-of-flight infrared cameras. Measured distances, along with infrared amplitude, are used to find key landmarks such as the location of the face and limbs. Gestures are recognized using motion history images created from the movement of the limbs over a short period of time. Okay, moving to goal. Octavia, stop. Stopping. Where is the fire? The fire is in the center on the floor. The human's gesture and speech redundantly indicate the approximate location of the fire. A pointing gesture produces a vector of high likelihood, while spoken keywords such as center or floor describe the bounding box. Together, the two indicate where the robot should begin searching. Area described by speech and gesture. Fires are localized using a pair of IR cameras, one in the head and another in the chest. Taken together, their information is fused into an evidence grid localizing the fire in three-dimensional space. Fire found. Moving to extinguish. To extinguish a fire, Octavia repeatedly aims the hose at clusters of the brightest locations extracted from the fire evidence grid. More advanced and effective fire classification and suppression algorithms are currently under development based on U.S. Navy damage control procedures. Fire extinguished.